If you are sharing files between PC to PC or PC to Android and you are using any third party apps like Shareit or Zender and maybe you are using pendrive or data cable right then maybe you are not aware about like Google has launched its nearby share beta and it is way more faster than other apps and I already made a video on that maybe you have watched but in this video I'm gonna show you how you can share file between PC to PC using nearby share and in the same way you can share between Android to PC and PC to Android here you can see this is my Windows 10 PC and and in that I already installed this nearby share so basically you just need to go to link and just download or install it's a very simple process after that you need to do some setting you don't need to log in here okay so no issue at all just go to settings and here you need to rename your device name and change your device visibility to everyone you will be able to see your device or other devices also so now all things are done so why I'm telling this app to use because this is an official legit app and you don't need to use any third-party Chinese app they are collecting data from your system right so don't use them use this this is also faster from them I already made a video on that by checking the speed okay so now I'm going to share my one file here like this one and I'm going to use my another Windows 11 laptop in that I already installed that you can see here this is my Windows 11 laptop and I already installed this nearby share beta from Google so just open it up so basically you need to turn on your Bluetooth and nearby share and make sure your Bluetooth is connected with each other right okay so in my another PC you can see desktop stops and so this is my device name on Windows 11 and let me select it and now you can see whenever you are not logged in with Google account it will show you to accept the request as you can see want to share a video just click here accept and now you can see the speed maybe you will see here less speed because this my laptop is not support 5g otherwise it will give you around 15 to 16 mbps depending on the file size so currently it is giving me 4 mbps on my laptop which is not supported 5g it is good speed so this is how you can share file between PC to PC right and same thing works with Android in Android you already have built-in nearby share and if you don't know how to do it you can follow my previous video so you don't need to use any pen drive data cable just copy from one system to another system so you can use this this is legit app and uh, enjoy it 